Welcome to the Data Mining for Finding Influencers, or Influencer Marketing, as they call it, case study. Now, before we get into the action phase and the looking at the dashboard, etc., we have to discuss why influencer marketing is important or why influencers are important. Now, it's great to, again, connect and follow, as well as target uh, the demographics that are connected to influencers, as we'll see in the Data Jacker memberships when we go over kind of a Ninja Facebook marketing interest-based uh, techniques, you know, to, to get at your demographics, okay? So it's very important to assess uh, in your uh, niche who's who in terms of uh, people, businesses, organizations, okay? Because, again, it's uh, not only for our sake uh, to, to connect or to, quote-unquote, name drop. That's not what we're trying to do here. We're trying to follow the right people so we can get to uh, the right markets, okay, so to speak, all right? So... Now, I can tell you that influencing marketing, influencer marketing and uh, finding influencers, you can find them in any niche and you can find them globally, all right, across across the globe, okay? Hundreds and thousands of them, okay? So depending on your niche, depending on what marketing market you're trying to uh, target, whether for yourself and or your clients, etc., you'll be able, you know, you'll be able to, to do that globally, okay, and for any topic and or niche. Now, there are companies online, and as you see from the sales page, you know that charge you know anywhere from fifty to a hundred dollars a month just to show you, you know, uh, kind of current lists of uh, influencers. Okay, now we can actually data mine for those uh, free. Okay, complimentary. Okay, in real time, automatically, and you can do that on a daily, like I said, weekly, monthly basis, depending on your or your client's needs. Okay, and you'll be able to do that not only for, in this case, we're looking at, uh, for example, Twitter, but you'll be able to do that for Facebook, for YouTube, for Google Plus, etc. Okay, so the possibilities again are endless. They're infinite, infinite. So you can do it for practically anything. Now, in front of me, I have kind of the top 25 uh, influencers across the board uh, globally, okay? So you can see uh, from, from the first, uh, from 1 to 25, we can see that uh, the top, uh, you know, influencers are Mashable, Wired, uh, and this one is a new one for me. I, uh, I actually want to check his site out. I need Dash, you know, interesting guy. Uh, Jeff Jarvis, Biz, uh, Stone, uh, Scobalizer, which is Robert Scoble, Robert Ebert, uh, Laughing Squid, Gina Tapani, etc., etc., etc. Okay, so I went and I, in this uh, dashboard, as you can see, you know, we have the place, the, I put a little thumbnail, the name of the you know the person or the organization or the business okay and their twitter profile so i can go and then follow them and interact with them again this is about trying to forge real relationships uh again if it's a person with a person or if it's a business within people within within that and also within the market that correlates to that uh business and or person all right this is the key for us as uh you know we try to uh kind of pinpoint influencers in different fields and across the globe now, these are, like I said, global uh, influencers. Now, I wanted to add marketing, the top 25, and also top 25 health. And then, so we'll, we'll have like 75 within, within like 10 seconds, we're going to have 75 people or businesses, organizations that are influencers in uh, general marketing and health so i because i wanted to show you that like i said this works across the board like i said i'm not, I'm not gonna take a lot of your time i'm gonna press to refresh and you can see that it's taking the data out it's actually going and and now we we have 75 in there so if you hold on one second i'm going to organize them and you can see them right away so as you can see you know like before We have uh, Mashable, we have Wired, okay? Now we go down past 25, and then we go to another set, you know, we can see that this is for marketing. Brian Solis, Mashable, Jeremiah Oyang, I hope I'm saying it right, Anne Hardley, Stephen Rubel, etc., are top guys in uh, marketing. And then if we go in terms of health, okay, we can see our famous uh, Dr. Oz from... Uh, 
Oprah uh, fame, then we have the World Health Organization, the New York Times Health, NPR, Mayo Clinic, uh, uh, Dr. Sanjay Gupta, he's from CNN, CDC, Women's Health, et cetera, et cetera. You can see that these are not only kind of uh, targets for us to connect with uh, online via social media and other venues, but these are also very interesting targets for us uh, in Facebook marketing, as we'll see within Data Jacker. Okay, so with that, I bid you farewell. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Kind regards, Ron.